Here in Chicago's Chinatown community, leaders are speaking out after a national increase in crimes targeting people of Asian descent. Let's go to WGN's Julian Cruz. He's live in Chinatown with more on their message. And they've been talking about this for a while, Julian. That's right, Lourdes. There is grave concern here in Chicago's yep. Chinatown community after Tuesday's massacre north of Atlanta. People here are already dealing with the pandemic and a spike in local crime, but it's the recent surge of hate crimes across the country against Asian Americans that has left this community shaken. We are a community of strength. We watch out for each other. Grace Chan McKibben and community leaders say residents are strong and resilient, but in this turbulent time of pandemic, recession, and virulent hatred, as we witnessed this week north of Atlanta, right now the people of Chicago's Chinatown are looking for your help. We need to work together with our brothers and sisters in other communities to make sure that we watch out for each other. So we call upon everyone to support Asian Americans at this time. And uh, thanks to uh, all the men to unite everybody together. To Tony Hu with the U.S.-China Restaurant Alliance urging Chicagoans to support Chinatown restaurants with the community now struggling with fear as hate crimes against Asian Americans surge. I mean, we have seen the escalation the last year alone. The numbers are clear. Tracking the rise is the Stop Asian American and Pacific Islander Coalition, reporting that across the country in the last 12 months alone, nearly 3,800 incidents of hate crimes have been reported, more than 68% of those cases verbal harassment, with 11% of reported incidents involving physical assault, and Asian American women reporting twice as many hate crimes as men. It appears in that incident in which the offender's in custody that uh, he did, in fact, target Asian Americans. Commander Don Jerome not buying reports that the accused Atlanta killer told investigators that he didn't target Asians during this week's bloody rampage that left eight people dead, six of the victims of Asian descent. Chicago police beefing up patrols in Chinatown, hoping to reassure frightened residents dealing with concern over hate crimes and by the recent surge in local crime. Some of the fear that has started escalating had to do with the increased number of robberies and carjackings. A perfect storm of circumstances with all the crime, the pandemic, the subsequent recession, and now it appears it's having an impact on people's mental health. Coming up in the 6 o'clock hour, we'll talk to medical experts who are seeing increased demand for mental health services here in this community. In Chinatown, Julian Cruz, WGN News. Yeah,